Ah. Yo, we talking about what? groceries on FBA. Ah. Yo, easy. Yeah. J to the O, the Mayos. Groceries on FBA. What you know about that? Hey guys, Sean Mayo here from Growth Reviews on FBA. Uh, today I'm going to show you a, uh, a great tool that we use. Uh, it's called the Amazon Assistant. Uh, it's a Chrome extension. Uh, and I'm going to walk you through um, how we use it and uh, what it does, installing it. Um, so here we are on the, um, in the Chrome store. Uh, I'll have the link in the description. And uh, we're just going to click on Add to Chrome, of course. And we'll click Add Extension. Now, uh, what this tool does is it allows you to, uh, when you're searching at uh, stores like Walmart or um, anywhere else you may be doing your uh, online arbitrage, uh, you can click on the logo um, and right here, and it is going to um, take you to uh, the Amazon page uh, that uh, it's matched with. Now, of course, it doesn't work every time. If it doesn't have UPCs or uh, other identifying marks at Amazon, uh, it won't be able to bring it up. Um, you know, and you should always double check, but for the most part, uh, this tool, um, uh, you know, quickly matches uh, the products uh, just with one click instead of having to go to Amazon and search for each product. So not only does uh, it match the items uh, where you're sourcing, uh, but it also has a couple of other options. Um, it has a, uh, a universal wish list, so you could be saving items at Walmart, saving them on Target, and saving them, uh, you know, uh, anywhere that you're sourcing, uh, and save them all to one, uh, to one list. Uh, so that that really makes things a lot easier when you're sourcing. Uh, maybe if you know you're sourcing before you get paid, or you're not ready to make your purchases, or you ordered your uh, online gift cards and they haven't come through yet. You can add these to the wish list and quickly go back uh, and order them in the future. Uh, it also has a, um, without having an extra search bar, I know there's several Amazon search bars, uh, but this one, um, you can just click on it and search on Amazon anytime you want, uh, which is um, really a good time saver without, uh, you know, cluttering up your, um, uh, your Chrome page. And this product also works internationally, so uh, if we go to the settings, and uh, you can change country so you know if you're looking at uh, comparing to um, your products to uh, the UK Amazon or Canada or whatever country you're working in uh, then it's very easy to just go here and and change it and um, you know go back and forth as you need to uh, so I've gone ahead and loaded up a uh, page on Walmart. Uh, so I just went to the Legos and looked at Scooby-Doo. Of course, this will look, work with any product. Uh, and it's $24.88. So when we load the, the page for this item, uh, as you can see at the top, uh, this comes up. Uh, and you can click here and go right to the Amazon page or uh, click on learn more um, it's going to ask you if the product's right or not um, and it, it'll take you to the page or you can click on learn more and buy um, which is going to take you to the same page uh, but if we go back here we can click on uh, the logo and uh, if the home is just the general search but if we go over to your list uh, you can see here, this is the item on Amazon, and you can add it to your wish list, uh, or you can, um, you can create as many lists as you want for uh, different things, or you can just click uh, add to your wish list. It'll have your name here, of course, uh, and it pulls the information uh, directly from Amazon. Uh, so now we've added this to, uh, to our wish list. It's coming from Walmart. Uh, and it says it's added, and now we can go back 
uh, over to now it'll load a page and it creates a, a new wish list for you but uh, as you can see this is the Lego Scooby-Doo added from Walmart.com and you can click on shop this website and it's going to take you right back to the page so um, not only is it comparing products but it's also um, going to allow you to create wish lists uh, on Amazon from other pages um, so you'll just be able to go to that list and click on the links and go back and buy whatever you want or if you want to keep an eye on the products there's, there's a lot of different things you can do with it um, so um, So yeah, this is a, um, a great extension. I mean, we use it, uh, we use it a lot um, when we're doing sourcing, or I have my VAs uh, doing the regular sourcing. We use this. We let them add. Uh, I have a, a separate um, Amazon account. If you're hiring VAs or employees, you might not want to give them access to your Amazon account. Um, but we do have a separate Amazon account just for doing research. So then uh, they can add them to, uh, to the wish list and then we can go back and purchase the products we want to buy. Thanks a lot.